Also tonight, a battle over the fate of an iconic East Bay landmark. KPI X5's Emily Turner on the proposed development that could change the face of an historic hotel. It has stood as a Berkeley and Oakland landmark since its construction in 1915. Now, new construction has the neighborhood around the Claremont Hotel concerned it could change the face and the pace of the place they live. It's hard to explain why, but I don't like the idea. I love the old fashioned look. It looks old, and I don't want something brand new looking right next to it. According to documents submitted to Oakland Planning and Zoning, the Claremont Hotel wants to take out some of the tennis courts and replace them with a new pool. A 43-unit condominium complex would join the traditional wooden building on the hillside, and a new special event space would be set up. Despite the drastic difference it could make to the hotel, it hasn't become a hot topic in the neighborhood yet. This is all you'll see posted about what may come. Since I haven't seen all the, the plans and had that many discussions about it, um, I would just like them to see more parking. It doesn't seem like there's enough parking spaces for the increase in membership for the club and for all of the condominiums. Those concerns will likely be highlighted at tonight's planning and zoning meeting. A local group called Save the Claremont has been handing out flyers, urging folks to show up and fight against the project. I hate to turn down somebody's idea of making money. It's you know not my business, but I, I hope they don't do it. In Oakland, I'm Emily Turner, KPIX 5.